Good morning everybody. It is Tuesday, 6.36 in the morning. We gotta get or make sure that everybody's up. I heard everybody's alarm clocks. So I have high hopes that we are getting up. I I'm trying to think what I want to give for breakfast. I'm thinking pancakes. I'm thinking pancakes with maybe a little whipped cream on top. Give them a little sugar to wake it up. And then I bought these from Aldi. You saw in my haul. Which kid is that? Oh, good morning. Oh, let me help you. I am going to try, my kids just left to go to school, but I'm going to try to drink a coffee today. We're going to see how it, how it works out, but I'm going to add all the bad things, all the creamer, all the whipped topping, and see if I can drink it. I just chugged. I don't know, three-fourths of a bottle of water. So we'll see how this does. I really miss my coffee mornings. That's like the one thing that I'm really... I can't wait to have after after this baby. is a really nice, good coffee. It is now 9.32. I laid on the couch after my kids left. And I just got done putting on a normal outfit. I... Am really 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 slow really 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 slow today but we have a whole list of things that need to be done so we got to get at it we got to get at it I feel I have like this burst of besides my slowness this burst of the feeling of needing to get all of my stuff crossed off so, I think that's what we're going to do today. And when I say, like, stuff crossed off, I mean, like, car wiped down and cleaned, car seat in the buckle, laundry done, sheets washed, all of that jazz. So, in order to get that done, though, I think I need to sit down and just, like, clear my head and write a list down. Why is my computer not turning on, though? I need to write a list. And then we need to hit up Dollar Tree and possibly Gabe's. So that is the plan. That is the plan for today. Errands and getting our stuff done. All right, vlog is up. I decided uh, not to drink. This is the coffee that I said. I tried, I tried. We also had a couple sips of a Mountain Dew. But I have... The vlog going that's live and done I went upstairs and made beds I collected all of the laundry I have that going right now I had a load that went in while I was uploading the vlog and then another load after it so one's in the washer one's in the dryer our next thing let me turn you around hold on we have to clean out the car go to Dollar Tree potentially get a Gabe's I waited until 10, it's 10.23 right now because that's when they're COVID, I think, hours. I think they're still doing it. I feel like it's been a little bit more lax. A little bit more lax now. But I have a list of Dollar Tree items that I need to pick up, like hangers for my kids. I just want to get everything, like all of my ducks. If I leave and go to the hospital when my kids are in school, I want their uniforms ready. You know, like, this is where it is, this is what you're wearing, this is what you do. So, unless I have the baby on Thursday or Friday or the weekend. Um, ideally, if I had the baby on Thursday or Friday, that would be great because then I would get out of the hospital and we could start our week fresh. But we'll see. We'll see. I also have a spray tan that I want to do. But I need to figure out where I'm going to hook up my machine. I'm thinking maybe over here. But I want to do a spray tan because I need one. 
definitely need one. All right, let's go. Let's clean out the car and wipe it all down. I noticed that on my video the other day. I was like, your steering wheel's a mess. You got stuff all around there. So we're gonna clean that out and then hit up Dollar Tree. So we went through the ATM off camera and I went to Kroger and got my gas tank filled. That was another thing that was on my list of things to do like in preparation was to fill my gas tank up before this baby. I wiped out my car, I need to wipe down right here. My makeup gets stuck on my hands and then it gets stuck on, it gets stuck on the leather. Do you all see that? We though are making a pit stop. I was on my way to Dollar Tree and then I thought, you know what? I need to eat lunch with my husband while my kids are in school and I'm by myself because this could be, you know, one of the last times that we can do that. So, he is meeting me here at Panera. I'm just waiting for him to get here. And we are going to eat some lunch. We are now out of lunch and I am in front of Dollar Tree. I think what I'm gonna do <clears throat> is go inside here, get the things that I need, and then head back home and finish the laundry and strip our bed and get those sheets and the washer and then potentially order a Kroger or Aldi Instacart delivery um, unless I can find a pickup time for later on. I was going to try to go to Gabe's, but I think I just, I'm at the point where I just got to pick and choose the places that I go and do the bare minimum and that's I think what I want to do just go to Dollar Tree and be done and then go home and order order our groceries I seen a couple of things but I got a strawberry banana smoothie from Panera I just finished it in the car while people watching I'm watching the BMV it every single time every time I come to the dollar store there is like 14 people deep out just standing randomly outside I need to I need to get my driver's license address changed but it's like I'm just gonna wait I think I'm just gonna wait until the craziness is over try to see like when a time slot that's not busy like it always is I mean it's 11:39, so maybe people took their lunch break I don't know Anyway, we're going to go inside Dollar Tree. I will be back out in a little bit and I'll show you what I got. I'm hoping maybe they have some Christmas stuff out. I know the last time I was here, they were starting to get boxes in. So we'll take a little gander at that. I'll be back. We are back from Dollar Tree. I thought I would just do a quick little haul. I got hangers for me and Cody. We only use the black plastic and hangers for my kids. The more baby clothes and stuff that I get, the more hangers that I need. So everybody, all the kids have white hangers. Us adults have black hangers. I got chicken broth, mushrooms, onion pan, and garlic powder. This is actually for the chicken tetrazzini that I'm gonna make for dinner tonight. I'm gonna put that in the crock pot, which is another one of the reasons why I came home. I need to get in the crock pot in the next five minutes and put it on high. I got toothbrush for me. I felt like, I don't know if the whole coronavirus thing, we probably should just change our toothbrushes out and I didn't have one, so I needed that. I also got myself a hairband. I just really liked the color and print of that. Some no bleed felt tip pens. I'm gonna see if I like those. I've been addicted to these. Uh, the last pack that I got was extremely minty and less like sugary, so I'm hoping this is more sugary and less minty. But we're gonna open those up in just a minute. And then everything that is in this pile is from the baby to my kids. So I'm gonna put little gift bags together and when I go into labor, uh, I will, before I leave, obviously set these on the countertop. But I just wanted to get them like a little something from her to say like, hey, we are friends here. So that's what all of this is for. All of this is for little Halloween bags that I'm gonna make my kids. Jet was born on Halloween, so it's his birthday morning, but I would like to just give them a little something. So 
that is what this stuff is for and I'm going to put those bags together also. Blue's birthday is um, in November, the first week of November, November 7th, I believe. I feel like I always get the date wrong. Um, we're gonna go with the 7th. I got him two little toys. The rest of my kids' birthday presents and the rest of Blue's, I'm buying either off of Walmart or Amazon. They both kind of have the same things. I also got a happy birthday banner. I got three of these little singing candles for all three of my kids and three rolls of happy birthday because you can never not, you know, when I, everybody's birthday in this house is anywhere from October 23rd until December 16th, including the dog. So I wanted to stack up on three little rolls. It's not much wrapping paper, but enough for me to like, you know, wrap Jet, Skylar and Sienna's birthday presents or whatever, so. And then I also got this two piece pumpkin carving kit. These always break, but these are really good to have. So, and I wanna carve pumpkins soon, but that's everything that I got. I'm gonna put these bags together and I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. It's 12.41. I have the chicken tetrazzini started. I just put in some chicken broth, a couple things of frozen chicken breast, some salt, some pepper, some onion powder, some garlic powder, and the mushrooms inside here. We're gonna cook that on high for four hours and then we're gonna add cooked noodles, some cream cheese, and some cheese and probably some more salt and pepper. Um, and then I'll serve that also with some butter bread. Also made these bags. I made the little Halloween bags for my kids and then I made each one of them from the new baby, just little knick-knacky toys. So I'm gonna hide these in my laundry room and probably sit down for a little bit. I will leave around 1.30 to go get my kids from school. So I think we will just chill until then. It's 1.39, Blue and I are gonna go pick up my kids. I told him car ride, he got super excited. So here we go. I did lay on the couch for a little while. I have quite a few things to do once my kids get home. Sienna from three to four has oh i need to make sure my phone is charged all the way she has a zoom audition for theater and then skylar has cheerleading from 5 30 to 6 30. i also at some point need to get or i need to cut jet's hair because he has pictures tomorrow so we need to do that but let's go get them it is now four o'clock we came home, Blue was so happy to see my children. I, while I was in the car, in the pickup line, I placed a Kroger delivery. Now, I haven't had groceries delivered since last, what was that, Monday, I believe, which was an Aldi haul. I'll do another Aldi haul next week. There are some things though that I like to get from Kroger. It just what is what it is. Um, I, though got it delivered it just came sienna also just finished her uh theater auditions i'm like putting two and two together finish her theater auditions i thought i'd just quickly go through everything this is just like supplemental things uh last week when i had the aldi haul i meal planned my dinners this week i just didn't i think i spent maybe a hundred dollars maybe 107 i forget what the total price was but this is just everything that we kind of sort of ran out of and dinner that we needed to get but i'll show you i'll show you everything that we got so groceries, I have a thing of 18 pack of Gatorade Zero. I have some Arnold Palmer's, which is half iced tea, half lemonade, and some water that I'm gonna put in these two refrigerated beverage things. And then over here, I'll start up top. I have just been buying paper towels. We didn't necessarily, like we're not out or anything. But I'm just going to um, start hoarding things since I'm getting so close 
Not that it matters anyway, because I get my groceries delivered, but in my mind, I think this is great. Um, also, dishwasher detergent. I got chips. The, what is that, Frito-Lay flavor mix. I've been craving some chicken lo mein, so I got two packs of those and some chicken egg rolls. That is dinner for, what is today, Tuesday? This is Thursday's dinner. This is breakfast for tomorrow. Tomorrow's dinner, it might, I might switch these two, but this is a dinner. And then I also have the Mississippi roast recipe in the crock pot. You just need a chuck roast, some aju gravy, some ranch seasoning packet, some butter, and some uh, pepperoncini peppers. So that with mashed potatoes is dinner, but you literally just put these four things in a crock pot with like a half a stick of butter cut into like little cubes and you let that thing go for like eight hours and it's delicious. I have King's Hawaiian Rolls, a uh, little mini frosted donuts, some Fiber One brownies, some caramel apples, which have been kind of like an obsession of mine personally. Um, I've been eating one like every night. Some strawberries, some grapes, some milk, some yogurt, some bread, hot dog buns, and a pizza. That'll be Friday. So Wednesday, Thursday, Friday dinner. And then some things like my kids have really been liking parfaits lately, um, cereal, and then I always sometimes do bacon and toast for breakfast. And then you can't go wrong with with fruit parfaits. So that's everything. Here is the finished product. It didn't modify. I used some rotini, the veggie kind noodles instead of spaghetti noodles. And I also topped it with mild cheddar cheese instead of I think it called for mozzarella. Or did it call for Parmesan? I can't remember. But those are the two modifications. I'll leave the recipe, if I remember, down below. It is now 6.30. Skylar's getting out of cheer practice. I just came up here and I told her I would just wait. That she could come right back here. So we'll see how she did. She looks like she did good with her Gatorade. Mom. Yes. Yes, ma'am. What? We're um, on Saturday. Mm -hmm. They said that this might be our last practice. Oh. Because on Saturday's game, they said that we're going to do a big performance. Thing. Yeah. Oh, that will be nice. Is, is that what you practiced today? Yeah. But you had a good, a good cheer practice? Yeah. All right. We are going to leave and go home. You already did your homework, so you're good. We'll probably just shower and get pajamas on. What is today, Tuesday? Yeah. I don't think we have anything to watch. Uh -huh. But we will head home. Let's go. We're waiting for Jet to get back from his haircut appointment. And then I'll quickly just show you Jet. And then I'm going to end the vlog. And hopefully get it all ready to go for tomorrow. Because I've been kind of slacking. I've been uploading them in the morning and like putting it off until like 9.30. So I wanna try to do it tonight while I'm you know, laying down. But I wanted just to say good night to you all and that I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll probably take it really easy tomorrow. I have no plans to go anywhere or do anything. So be prepared. I think I'm, the only thing that's on my to-do list is to um, spray tan myself. And that's it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, bye. It's not thinking about it, so it's nighttime. <laughs>